Hi, Head of Lettuce here. I just got off stage at Cherry Grove Fire Island and walked back to my little hobbit house here in the Grove. And I'm a, I don't know, I'm just a sweaty old hoe to be quite honest with you. Look at me, I just, I'm, I'm drenched in seagull feathers and, oh, I don't even know what to talk about, girls, but let me tell you something. All the rage this season in Fire Island, this summer in Fire Island, the thing that is completely in is spit roasting. And what is a spit roast? It's not something you get at your barbecue, bitches. No, a spit roast is simply this. You get a person. They bend over. Uh-huh, they bend over. Their mouth is this way, their ass is that way. What is a spit roast? Someone shoves their cock in your mouth as someone shoves a cock up your ass. And boom, you're a human accordion. All the kids are doing it. It is called spit roast. Spit roast is the new black bitches. You better get in it, learn it, live it, and love it. Because you know what? You may be at a barbecue this summer, and someone will say to you, Hey, do you want a spit roast? And you'll say to yourself, Huh, I'm at a barbecue. He wants to spit roast me. And you'll know what a spit roast is. It's not a fucking piece of meat with a glaze over it. You're the piece of meat, and they glaze you. So you see these 21-year-old Twinkies are running out on town taking their fucking prep Truvada, taking loads up their ass and getting spit roast left and right. Do you know how many cocks a twink can take up their ass nowadays? In my days, two or three. These fucking twinks today are fucking power twinks. They can take 10, 15, 20 cocks in one sitting. That is one sitting. That is all five food groups in one fucking sitting. In my day, they thought we were hoes. No, these bitches nowadays, these fucking 20-year-old kids on their fucking prep and Travada, fucking bending over and taking load after load, whites and darks. We call them the washing machine queens. They're taking everything. Greedy, hungry, hungry little hippos. And they're being spit-roasted left and right. That's like on the first date. It's no longer going to a movie. It's no longer going, oh, can we want to go to the, the soda shop and split them all? No, let's go to my house and fucking spit roast. You fucking young queens are fucking crazy with your little fag bags that have your poppers, your lube, your fucking douche, your molly, your wally, your poly, all that shit that you take to get high because you can't be in the moment without your fucking molly and your poppers. Listen, bitch, Papa Burns aren't ain't cute. They're not. I knew a drag queen named Papa Burns. Her fucking face was fucked up. Do you want to look like Papa Burns? No, you don't. Do you want to live your life being spit-roasted? Do you know what happens to an asshole after it's been spit-roasted for too many years? An asshole's not like a pussy, bitch. An asshole don't bounce back. It doesn't bounce back. You can't tighten that fucking shit up again. So I'm telling you right now, cut it out. Because you don't want to be a loose hole at the barbecue. Because everyone's going to point and everyone's going to snicker. And they're not laughing with you. They're laughing at you, silly fool. So all you twinks out there, get off your grinder, get off your scrub. Just get off it completely. Go out with people. Read a fucking book, you idiots. Do something useful for a change. Waste of a life, I tell you. Was that too strong? <laughs> it's just tough love. And remember, if you see something, don't say something. And let us some bitch at a barbecue getting spit roasted. And know what you do? You slap those cocks out of his fucking ass, and you hand him a book, and say, develop your mind, not your asshole. Your asshole will give out. Your mind never will. I'm done. Mm.